Hello everybody and welcome back to another plan with me. I am here for the week of February 26th through March 3rd. I am using the bookish kit from Scribble Prints Co. I knew the second I saw this art I had to use it. I feel like I've tried to use almost every single book art that's been released because they're all just so perfect and I'm obsessed with this one. I love the spring colors. I feel like it's a really great trans transition from February to March. Um, I always feel like I almost always use book kits in february or march weird but also oh, they're just so pretty and the colors of this so gorgeous i'm obsessed so that is the kit that i am using unfortunately i did not need a single extender this week so i feel like there was a couple of boxes that like i would have been totally fine and like happy using but like didn't get to use and i'm a little sad about it but i still am so happy with this i grabbed both fashion sets too so i feel like that definitely attributed to it but i just needed to use both fashion boxes they're so cute but anyways so with this kit i am using the scribble prince co foil bundle this is the flower or daisy flower daisy one of the two foil bundles in like an ice blue it's so pretty I really wanted to bring out the blue in this kit because there is blue, obviously, as one of the four main colors, but in the full boxes, it's a lot of the pink, a lot of the purple, and a lot of the green. So I really wanted to kind of tie in more of that blue, and I think this, like, flower bundle really does it, and it's so pretty, and it's, like, very, like, early spring, and I just, ugh, I'm obsessed. So that is what I did. I'm, I haven't used one of the new foil bundles yet, so it was very fun and exciting. I love the, bun like, the bougie boxes. I love the bottom washi, and I especially love the whole reinforcers i was so excited for those the deco turned out super super cute i was able to pop in a few of those like floral deco bits as well my days of the week are from hannah i do have a code with planet hannah you can use the code fantasy 15 to save 15 percent plus get my cute little freebie these are silver and they're in her font five i am a huge huge fan of font five for the days of the week i don't know what it is about it being kind of like more bold more like I don't know, just more like bold in your face and you can see it, especially over the deco. And then the date numbers are from the foil bundle. I don't have a February script popped in yet because I ran out of silver Februaries. I guess I used like a couple silver this year and then probably a couple last year. So I gotta pick up some of those months so I can pop in a silver February, but I will be using the Scribble Prince Co. ones. Those are my current favorite. I am obsessed. I only started one book this week, so I only had to pop in one on the sidebar. But yeah, everything is very like, floral explosion in your face and I'm very obsessed with it I think it's gonna look so good once like the day by day is put down I'm also especially obsessed with the stroke box with that flower in the corner I loved being able to kind of rearrange it for Tuesday and Thursday I think that turned out really cute and then of course I pulled in some quote overlays what kind of base would it be if I didn't pull in a quote overlay um I pulled in the they're both from Hannah. One is Read in Silver and the other is Inspire 5. I pulled one from Inspire 5, the one that is on the top left sidebar box that says Happy. I thought because it says Happy and then there's like a bunch of flowers around it, it would really go well with the spread. So I did that. And then the other ones are like very bookish. So we have the Book Nerd on also on the sidebar. Uh, buy me books and tell me I'm pretty on Wednesday. And then on Friday, it just says Crazy Book Lady obsessed i mean aren't we all like don't we all want our shelves to look like the the double box like seriously that's how i want my shelves to look but yes i believe that's the base is there's anything else i can't think of anything i'm just obsessed with how it turned out i especially just love the sidebar because you have like the bookshop the stack of books the girly reading with her little coffee like obsessed 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 so let's go ahead and jump into the day by day i don't even have my notes or anything pulled up so give me a second here because i was not fully prepared okay, so let's go ahead and jump into the day by day i'm also gonna take a little sip of water i'm parched okay so starting on monday i did go to work this day is this lighting all right hopefully it's not like too too bright It'll be okay once my hands are in. Perfect. I did go to work this day. I collated foil bundles all day, so I am going to pop that in with a squared box. Let's do pink. I'm going to put it a little bit closer to the top here because I did 
Also, I was like, I don't know, I've been watching Gilmore Girls and I was caught up on YouTube videos and such and I was like, I need something that's like really fast because Gilmore Girls is like a little bit slower and I needed something to make the day go by quicker because I like, I was already out of YouTube videos to watch by like 11 and I had a few hours still to go. So I decided, you know what, I'm gonna look on Netflix and see what they have and see if there's any like reality trash show that I wanna watch. And I saw that the Real, the Real World Austin was on there and that's the only real world season I've ever seen. I saw it when I was a kid, obviously. Isn't that so ironic too that that's the only season I ever saw was Austin and ended up moving to Austin? Crazy. But I saw it was on there. There's only like two real world seasons. So I put on Austin. I've since binged the entire season. Honestly, real world needs to come back. But it was so cool to see like old Austin. And like I knew some of the places they were showing. And like it was just cool. So and they ate it like Chipotle all the time. Which I thought was hysterical. Plus it just felt again nostalgic. Because I watched it when I was basically a kid. But anyway. So for work I have the printer. Yes, I collated foil bundles. That's from Papershire. But I'm sure I printed something as well, so that works. And then this work script is from the foil bundle. And then for my binge watch, I have the Netflix Doodle here from the Doodle add-on. And then this binge watch is also from the foil bundle. Perfect. Um, we got in and out for dinner. Let's do... A little thing for in and out I was really really tired this day like extra extra sleepy so I'll mark that with one of these and then I ended the night by reading let's do this for reading bring in some more pattern cool so for in and out I have the takeout bag from the doodles um, for being super tired, I have a paper and milk Maru, Sleepy Maru. I tried to match that color as best as I could. That matches more of the green, but that's okay. This Sleepy AF, is that the chair? Yes. Or is that Reagan crying? It's the chair. My chair made like a really weird squeaky noise and it sounded kind of like a cry. Nervous. Anyway, that Sleepy AF is from the foil bundle. This is an open book doodle from SPC. And I have a reading time also from SPC. Love it. On to Tuesday. Tuesday, I filmed first thing in the morning, which is what I've been doing pretty much every day lately. And it's how I'm catching up. So like this plan with me that I'm currently filming isn't going out for like two, three weeks. It's been amazing. It's like life changing. Waking up first thing in the morning and filming. So I did that. Um, and then I basically just made wax all day long. So we will mark that. I kind of want to use this mark making wax basically all day and then I also did a ton of computer work this day as well I had a lot to do so I will use another little thing works for me to mark that so for filming in the morning I have the planner doodle from the add-ons I'm just not gonna say if it's from the add-ons unless it like isn't you know what I'm saying so like just assume if it's a doodle it's probably from the add-ons especially if it matches the colors but I'll let you know if it's not this film script is from Hannah and Silver. It's from the YouTuber sheet. This make wax is a doodle here. And I do have a custom make wax script. I think the air just kicked on. It is a little chilly in here. And then for working on the computer for a good chunk of the day, I have the computer doodle. And I grabbed this work all day script from SPC. I need to possibly get computer work customs. I'm trying to decide if that's what I want or not. Anyways, um, then I cooked dinner this night. It was really easy. I just made chicken sandwiches, air fryer, super simple. But I made them, so we're marking it. And then we, did we start watching? Yes, we started watching Beef this week. So I'll put that in on Netflix. I will say the first, I'm going to be honest, the first like three or four episodes were awesome. And then I just like really didn't enjoy the ending. Brian didn't enjoy it either. But what really bothered me is I don't like Ali Wong as an actress. I like her as a comedian so much, but I can't stand her as an actress. She just moves her mouth too much. That's like, it's such a picky thing to say, but like she just acts with her teeth and with her lips. And it just like, I don't know how to explain it, but it drives me mad. So like, 
I just, it was driving me nuts. And of course I love, oh, I don't even remember the other guy's name, but he's Glenn from The Walking Dead. I'm obsessed with him. He was so good. And the brother too. Anyway, so we started watching Beef this week and then I read. What do I want to mark for reading? Maybe something a little bit bigger because the space is quite big. So we'll just use this. Okay, so for cooking dinner, I grabbed this cute little chef hat that I didn't know was on the foil bundle. I was like, oh, that's like actually cute. So I'm gonna pop that there. And then this cook dinner is a custom from Hannah. It's in font two. And then for watching beef, I have the TV doodle. And I did get custom beef scripts made from Hannah. Again, font two, my fave. And then for reading, I have the book stack scribbler. I was trying to use at least like one kind of character based sticker per week and not just all or per day and not just all doodles. And I feel like I might have succeeded. I didn't, I have to look, but anyway, so that works. And then this read script is from the foil bundle. I had originally had this script with this one and this script with this one, but because the sticker is a little bit bigger, I felt like this kind of evened it out. And then this one's smaller, so that evens that out. Crazy things, but it works. So that was my Tuesday on to Wednesday. One, two, three, four, perfect, four per. So I started the morning with doing the dishes. Let's grab this. I also made wax all day. So we'll mark that a bit bigger. Let's use a pink pattern to mark making wax. I also filmed this day. Oops, sorry about that. And I watched the Nottingham Forest game this day as well. Perfect. So for doing the dishes, of course, I have one of my favorite doodle sheets from SPC. I actually need to get a, another sheet of these. I only have three left. It's just the open dishwasher. I'm obsessed with it. Um, yeah, it's my favorite. So there's that. I do have a custom dishes script that I got made from Planet Hannah. This, again, is in font two. Um, for making wax, I have a Once More With Love munchkin here with the wax melter. Custom make wax script. For filming, I have the YouTube laptop doodle. And this film script is also from the Plan and Hannah YouTuber sampler in silver. And then for the Nottingham Forest game, I have the like goal with the soccer ball doodle from SPC. Excuse me. And then this Nottingham Forest uh, custom is from Hannah as well. That matches, or like matches it fit perfectly. Hopefully this lighting's like really not that bad. I'm just gonna keep turning it because I feel like it's just really bright. Okay, I did edit some videos this afternoon, so I will mark that in. We had a pizza night, which I think I can use a little thing for. Yeah, a pizza night. We watched some more beef. I'll use a green pattern, so I haven't touched the green pattern yet. And then I read, which I'm gonna use something a little bit bigger for. Mm, we'll use the solid like piece here for my greeting. Okay, so for my editing, I have the laptop doodle here. I have an edit script from the Planet Hannah YouTuber sampler. It comes in real handy. Might have to get more of those. Um, for our pizza night, I have the little pizza foiled icon here from the foil bundle. For beef, I have the TV foiled icon. This is like the flat screen one, which is really cute. Again, that custom beef script. And then for reading, I have a Once More With Love munchkin here with their stack of books. And this read script is from SPC. There you go, so that is the first half of the week. We'll go ahead and switch it out for the second. Perfect, cool. So on Thursday, again, not too bad, okay. So Thursday I filmed in the morning. Get used to that, I feel like, because I've been on a roll and it's been so nice. Made wax pretty much all day, so we'll mark that a little bit bigger. I think I'm gonna go ahead and do the same thing I did before and use this, because I love it. And I also did laundry this day. I feel like my laundry day has changed so much recently. Okay, so for filming this day, I have the two sticker sheets, doodle, as well as another film script from that Planet Hannah YouTuber sampler. 
For making wax, I grabbed a doodle from SPC of another shot cup. I tried to match as best as I could, and I feel like that pink matches fairly well. And I do have a custom make wax script. For doing the laundry, I have the washing machine doodle as well as the full laundry script from the foil bundle. I have to do laundry today, actually. Cooked dinner this this night. I made spaghetti. I feel like spaghetti or like pasta has been my my Thursday normal. So I'm gonna make that a little bit bigger, I think. And then we watched two TV shows this night back to back. We watched Abbott Elementary, which is a fave, and then of course we watched Beef because that's what we were currently binging. And I ended the night by reading in green. Mm, let's do, I wanna do this. I've been really liking this little, it's a little big. Those little pieces are cute, but I guess not. Let's do a little thing then. Pattern is fine. Okay, I probably could have spaced those better to fix to fit that, but I just didn't want to. So from Paper Muse Crafts, I have this girly chopping up some vegetables, even though that's, I guess I had some onion there in the sauce. This cook dinner is a custom from Hannah. For Abbott, I have the TV icon from the foil bundle, the smaller blue one. And I do have a custom Abbott Elementary script. And then for beef, I went to the silver TVs from SPC. And again, that beef script. And then for reading this night, I have these smut sticker. Actually, I guess the book I was reading, it was Too Late by Colleen Hoover. I guess it was a little bit smut, but we'll pop that in here. I love those anyway, and the purple just matches the spread. So like, honestly, it works. Read script is from SBC. All right, on to Friday. Friday, I went back to work. I did orders. Um, let's use one of these because I'm obsessed with these and I haven't used one in a minute. So I did orders this day. I also had a new release. It was our Princess Diaries 2 collection, which I'm really excited about. I kind of want to work that a bit bigger as well. So that's what I'm going to do. We'll use this to mark our new release this day. So for doing orders at work, oh, I just dropped the sticker right on the ground. Let's pick it up. I went to pick it up with my tweezers and it just like didn't stick. <laughs> so the sticker is from Paper Shire. Just the gal packing up some sticker orders and I did grab the work script. I don't know why I didn't grab an order script, but whatever. This work script is from the foil bundle. And then for the Princess Diaries new release, I have the little princess um, scribbler from SPC because I wasn't quite sure what I wanted to use for that. And I thought that was really cute. It's the blonde one because, actually I should have probably just grabbed the brown haired one. But I grabbed the blonde one because I just went into the Reagan section to be quite honest with you. And this Fantasy Wax new release is a custom. I'm sure I'll remember that eventually. Did have a massive headache this day, so I will mark that in. They come sometimes, it was this day, which sucked. Um, we had canes for dinner. Raising canes, we watched some beef. And, um, oh, I started reading too late this day, but whatever. So I started reading a new book this day. So let's mark, oh, hello, this in, this. Again, the spacing could be better, but it's fine. So for my headache, I grabbed the headache sticker here from Once More With Love. I have a Cane's Doodle from SPC. For Beef, I grabbed the Silver TV from SPC as well again as that custom beef script. That's what happens when you binge a show every day. It looks like this, like Abbott, once a week, easy. But every day, every day, that's just how it is. For starting a new book, of course, I have the Start New Book sticker from Once More With Love, because it's a fave, as well as a custom Start New Book script from Hannah. On to Saturday, I'm actually gonna pause, I'll be right back. Okay, on to Saturday, sorry, I needed some water bad. Um, one, two, three, four, sure. Um, Dortmund had a game this morning, so I will mark that in. Uh, I just used blue, so I need pink. Let's grab a pink label for the Dortmund game. We went to the park with the kids this day. Um, let's mark that with this. And then afterwards we went to Torchy's Tacos for like lunch, it was delish. I love Torchy's. Let's use this to mark. 
So for the Dortmund game, I have a pink soccer ball from SPC. Again, I tried to match. I think I did a pretty decent job. This BVB game day is a custom. For the park, I have this like little swing set sticker here from Once More With Love. And I have the With My Love from the foil bundle because I just thought it was cute and I was with my loves. So there's that. And then for torchies, this is like from a like an assorted doodle sheet from SPC, but it's the margaritas. And I don't I don't drink usually. But sometimes like something calls to me like for example the cheesecake factory incredible strawberry daiquiris it tastes like juice but at torchies man i saw the margarita on the menu and i was just like mm, you know what it's hot that looks good so i got margarita and it was fantastic so that's from the assorted one of the assorted uh food sheets from spc i do have a custom torchies script from hannah and then it's funny because we were like right next to the grocery store but i was like i don't feel like going obviously I had a drink in me. So I was like, I'm gonna order groceries online because I don't wanna go. So I did order groceries this day. Also painted my nails. That's another thing I need to get back into. I, kept, I fell off it quick, but I painted my nails this day. Austin had a game. I've really been neglecting these uh, solids. Oh, perfect green too, so cute. And then it was a late night. Um, I'm pretty sure Austin had one of the late games and I stayed up and watched it, it was very late. So late night for me. So for my ordering of groceries, I have the grocery cart doodle and then I have this curbside pickup script. I didn't pick it up till the next day, but this curbside pickup script is from SPC. It's on my sampler in case you want it. Uh, for painting my nails, I have the nail polish bottle from the doodles as well as a custom paint nails from Hannah. That's so cute. For the Austin game, I have a soccer ball here from Carly Plans, as well as a custom Austin FC game day. And then for the late night, I was like, I don't know what I want to use. I went to my sleep section, but I was like, nah, this is really cute. This is a little doodle or like a foil bundle doodle, foil bundle icon. That's what it's called. It's just a moon and some stars. I'm like, that's really cute for like a late night, you know? So perfect for that. Then last but not least, onto the most boring day imaginable Sunday. I worked, I did orders, so we're just gonna do that because nothing happened. This is from Stick With The Plan Co, very cute. And then I did finally pull out my order script. This is a custom from Hannah, font two. Um, we got takeout for dinner. I don't, I didn't write down exactly what it was. Oh, was it? I don't remember. Got takeout for dinner. I can't remember where we got it from. Why did I not write it down? Your guess is honestly as good as mine. Um, let's grab a pink solid. For takeout, we watched some beef. I feel like we got it done in like, what's it called? Beef got done in like a week. And then I read, what a good day. Green, I need purple, 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 purple. Oh, let's use this, perfect. To mark reading. So for our takeout dinner, I have this little takeout box here. It's a doodle from SPC. The green matches pretty well. Actually matches very well. For beef, again, I have that silver TV and the beef script. Beef. I could save those for if I ever, ever cook beef. That's kind of funny though. I have the bookmark doodle from SPC to mark reading as well as a reading time script from SPC as well. Oh, that's really cute too. So that is the day by day friends. Let's go ahead and zoom out, show you the whole thing. I'm kind of obsessed. I love that you can see the, um, what's it called? The bougie boxes, the underlays so well because it's like a nice pop of floral. I'm obsessed with how this turned out. This is the colors, like such a good transition. You know what I mean? Like love, love, love. Ooh, springtime. You know what I mean? Like that's so pretty. Um, also, I haven't done that in a while. Showed the transition, but like I love when they're completely different. So that is it for this plan with me. I'm going to pop that February script on as soon as I bring it home from work in a couple of days. But I hope you guys enjoyed. Go ahead and subscribe to my channel if you're not already. And I will see you guys in my next one. Bye guys.